<laughs> how this is a new atelier showroom for you. Yes, yes. This is, um, we've been open almost a year. My studio, which is attached, we've been here for about five years. And Stacy and I, who have already sort of hungrily looked around, are referring to this as the torture chamber because we are just overwhelmed by the choice and the beauty. Everything of yours is just to die for. I always know it's you. I Thank always you. know it's a mountain wine, but yet you always surprise me. Thank you. You are creating these designs yourself, which yes. I think is very yeah. exciting. Well, this is actually a big part of what I set out to do, is work with artisans and come up with my own designs, but to have them be based on what the artisans were doing originally, um, what, you know, what is ethnic and what's traditional. So it really is a dialogue. Okay, I'm kind so, of freaking out about that one. I love these velvets. And these so, are something uh, that a lot of people don't know about. When I started making this design, very early on in working with the artisans, they made a mistake and they didn't seam it up correctly. Mm -hmm. And my first reaction was, oh, look at that. They didn't seam them correctly. And then about two minutes later, I realized how beautiful it looked mm -hmm. and the that it really had a very modern um, effect and uh, broke beautifully in the pattern. So now we intentionally do that. Now, if I'm coming in and I want to be inspired and create a bes bespoke carpet with you, are we going to this right away once we have our design? Once we have our designs, all of these are different materials as well. So we have piles of wool, silk, or we have cotton. These are all cotton pieces down here. Also, if you don't have the color you want, you can bring in the exact color you want. Okay, nicest office bathroom award. Thank you. I've been I, hitting I up the Joe time. Malone moisturizer like oh, right. so tomorrow. Yeah. And your lighting fixture, it's, it's so like you. Every detail isn't fussy, but it's perfect. Thank you. And um, dying over this. This is a wallpaper that I made for the New York Print Fair at the Armory. And I made this for the fair with the idea that it would look hand painted. And it totally does. It so, looks like yes. literally you, in, in the finest of ways, yeah. in the most artistic of yeah. ways, that you did this all these little just outside the line. Yeah. And look at the detail. If someone did not know anything about you and came from Mars, mm -hmm. and they, I would take them here first just okay. to orient them on, on what you've been doing so wonderfully for so long. And Thank you. Yeah. Um, so this is a carpet that we call Brook. That's the name of it. This is obviously taken from Islamic design. I love the sheen of this, this lavender with the, the kind this, of this silver. This is, um, I love this. This is a different, uh, what creates the sheen here. This is silk and this is wool. It's funny, when I was looking at um, one of your postcards where you had all different rugs and I thought, okay, if I had to pick, which one? And I did pick this one, if uh, I had this from FYI. Oh, okay. For Christmas for okay. my living room. <laughs> but I just thought I love the oversized, the, the boldness of it. Yeah. One thing you mentioned, uh, I read about, uh, you said that you had to find a way that the floor should have a dialogue with the rest of the walls yes. and the ceiling so it's not, and I don't think people, I think you've really helped people see how important that is and you've taken floor covering such a long way because it really Thank did you. start yeah. out as such a sort of staid yes typical expected and now of course people are much more open to being bold so we're in your amazing studio this is i think a place where people dream about creating and you have given it to yourself yeah, i'm really happy with my studio so you collect photos of india i do i first started going, I would say 1998. These are all old, as you can see. Some of them are the turn of the century, some of them are 50s. And I've worked very hard to make sure that I included all aspects of Indian life. So, so excited to see your office. Okay. Don't think that you're not gonna show me your okay. office. You're like going that way, we're going in there. Okay. Oh, it's so great. Now, so, now we talked about narrowing it down. You had to decide what of all your textiles you got to choose for your own curtains for these fabulous uh, windows. I love these curtains. This is Georgette chiffon. I wanted something that was like a negligee, but a for negligee my window. A negligee for the window. Exactly. Love that. And everywhere you have inspiration. You have things. These are things you're working on. These are things that you love. Yes, these are things that I love. These are my fabrics. Over here we have um, all the ads my ads. Done. My wool carpets are my paintings. My flat carpets are like drawings, you know, the, yes. the cotton carpets. Uh -huh. They're very flat and clean, so it's like a drawing. And that my ads are my collages. And so I see the dogs are in their studio apartments, as they, you call They just love hanging out in their little bags here. And yeah. this 
Is this a Komodo? This is, this is, we don't know what it is. But this is I, what inspired I, you. This inspired my Komodo. This is a photo that I saw at the um, Noi Gallery. Are you it, selling that these? It looks beautiful. It, they, it is sold at the Noi Gallery. It's so um, comfortable. It looks beautiful on Thank you. Thank you. And um, this is the kind of thing that you want at like five o'clock at the yes. end of the day, but you're not, you're like, what do I want right now? I want to sort of take off, but I don't want to be in a nighty walking around exactly. my house. Exactly. I want something like the next layer down. And is this what you did for BAM? I just designed um, a carpet for the BAM Opera House. I liked using purple because it was in sharp contrast to the red and all over. And then I've inspired it with pieces that are architecturally relevant to BAM. Do you think like if I walked down the street in this, I bet you people would look at me differently. Yeah, I might have to just take a little jaunt in it and see what happens in my life. All right, thank you so oh, much. You're the best. Thank you for that coming. Was so fun. Congratulations. This is extraordinary. Thank you. It's so good to see you. Me too.